I'm dead. God, I hate poison. You better say I'm gonna kill Lydia again. I can actually save again just in case. Oh, for some reason I thought that was in. Wait, is that a chest? No. Is it? No, I suppose. Okay. Uh. Let me look at the map. So the judge is off to my left. I want to go over here. Eventually, I am going to stream Oblivion as another game that I started to abandon for various reasons. And I really dislike the uh, Persuasion Reel. It's usually my only favorite part in the game, and oftentimes I end up bribing people to get what I need. Wow. Uh, Pack Meal, I need you. I've got your back. How can I serve you, my Thane? Uh, so eventually I'm gonna need, uh, uh, there I go again, completely forgetting everything. See, I hope you realize just how bad my memory is. I'll just be talking about something, and then I'll forget, forget, like, seconds later. That's just how bad my memory is. I swear to God, eventually I'll get good at this whole commentator thing. It's just... What the fuck was I talking about? Ah! Hey, do I have any dragon bones? That's not that I could get rid of. I have a lot of stuff in your cell. You hear a dog barking, I really do apologize for that. I can't really do anything about it. I don't have any, but I do have this. I bring up some space. Let's get going then. Alright. Really, that's the second time I just completely lost my train of thought, and I really need to stop doing that. It's really a sign of things to come if I just forget things 35 minutes into the stream. But it's just my mind's just been focused on other stuff. It's been a really stressful week. We are currently three weeks away from finals week. It's at the point of the semester where, where things are really building up. Uh, I have a second term paper that is due in two weeks. I'm working on revision right now. I have to write a short story for my creative writing class. I know exactly what I'm going to write about. It's just me sitting down and actually writing it. That's the problem. Uh, I actually already got started on it. I just haven't finished it. And to top that all off... <laughs> Top that all off, Al. Uh, my classes. I also have the stress of graduation and getting ready for grad school, and uh, it's something that I really want to do is to get the master's degree. And I know it's just going to be such a pain because my dad went for his master's degree when I was in high school. And it took him so long. Ooh. It took him so long to be able to, uh... 
to be able to finish this thesis, and I'm really worried about that. I'm really, there's a shift in there. And there's a bunch of, okay, I'm gonna risk it. Probably shouldn't, I'm gonna try. Okay, it's over there. That didn't take long. That didn't take long at all, that's really nice. Dorman, oh, I need cons on gears, whoops. Uh, you're not gonna give me any cogs. Oh, that's not a chest, that's a bench. That was such a waste. I thought that was a chest. Really all there is, okay, well that was well worth the three lockpicks I used. I thought for sure that was a chest. I was say, oh, there's bound to be something good in there. Nope, a waste of time. How much do I have? Oh, well, I'm close to my current capacity again. Uh, Gorman and Cog, I have eight. I need two more. They are ten pounds each. I need to get rid of some stuff. Still here. I am sworn to carry your burdens. So I really wish there's a way to sort things by carry weight. Because uh, I know for a fact that letters and stuff don't weigh anything. Don't want to get rid of any of my keys. Don't want to get rid of any of my potions. Want to see... Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and give her my uh, dwarven bolts. And apparel. Give her that. Uh... Give her that. Don't really care about the skilled helmet. I'm just gonna sell this, and I, I don't know if companions can use scrolls. I really don't. If she does use scrolls, she may end up using this and kill herself because she's an idiot. So I'm not going to give her that. Instead, I will give her... Any books. Not much. I'm giving her the dormant stuff aside from the cogs for now. I'll let him take it off for later. I have a lot of stuff I need to get rid of and sell. Alright, I'm good. Lead on. Now which way did I come from? I came from over here. That stuff I opened. Alright, I know where I am now. So there's also this here. It just has a bench and nothing else, so that's great. I'm not gonna loot the farmers. I'm pretty sure that I just kinda left them alone. They really shouldn't have anything of interest.
I really, it's getting dog poison is a temporary effect. Maybe you can handle this. Don't want to, uh, get myself killed if uh, Lydia can handle it because I don't want to accidentally kill her. I don't want to kill myself. Back to that being said, let me go ahead and save. I'll go ahead and mine this and then I'll save. I still don't know if I need Moonstone, so I'm just getting as much as I can for now. Because Moonstone, if I remember correctly, is kind of a rare material. Like, there's so many iron mines, there's a little silver and gold mines. Uh, but I believe Moonstone is fairly rare. again. They keep on poisoning me, that's not really that nice. Thank you, Lydia, for that arrow. Uh, let me actually check. I don't think there's an alchemy skill, but I really want to check right now. There is. Okay, so eventually I'm going to have to uh, max this out. I, I checked three different sources, and uh, they say that it is necessary for 100% to master all skills and there's actually lesser mastery skills. So eventually all I have to master alchemy. So uh, I won't worry about that later. I will when I get to the end of the game when all I have left is just a few things then I will look into best ways or fastest ways to master this skill. There is already is like several, this game is so old and has so many glitches and I know the fact some of those glitches still work. So uh, I did see a video recently saying how to uh, get, I, I think it was like pickpocketing or something, like how to get pickpocketing to level 100 fast. So I know there is fast ways to do that, it's just a matter of pulling it off and hope that it hasn't been patched in this edition. Really, I don't... Where the heck is he actually in this place? I don't think that, uh... I honestly don't know where I am. I don't think that they will... They have patched this because this game is a decade old. And if I remember correctly, this is just like a reskin. Uh, uh, like, a, essentially, like, it's the same game from 360 just made for, uh, Xbox One. They didn't do any changes to it, as far as I can tell. They just made the graphics a little bit better, and that's it. So, uh, that is something that I, uh... That is something I'm gonna have to look into. Uh, is uh, figure out quick ways to get my skills to max level so I can do the master quest. I again don't want to. This is close quarters, and I don't want to accidentally. I don't want to accidentally kill Lydia.
Did he just back up? There we go. For a second there, I thought the fall would have gotten an execution on me, and I was getting a little bit worried. I actually do have gold. For some reason, I thought you didn't. Oh, I am full. Never mind. Whoops. All right, so we made it here. For some reason, I thought that was a chest. Uh, moving on. Something that I think is kind of interesting. I am a huge fan of YouTubers that go for 100% because there are several games I have no interest in playing. And, uh, like, say Final Fantasy, I would never in a million years sit down and play Final Fantasy. It's just I have no interest in those games. But I do love the story. Like, Final Fantasy VII is one of my favorite uh, stories in the Final Fantasy games. And my least favorite Final Fantasy game is Final Fantasy X, which may be a bit controversial. It's just, I hate the character Titus. I just think he's so annoying. But, uh... I do like YouTubers that do 100%, and there's this one YouTuber that I've been following for a while. So, uh, YouTube name is All the Shinies. He is a primarily PlayStation uh, player, and he's just kind of like the polar opposite of me, primarily an Xbox player. And I just think it's kind of interesting because he recently has just kind of hit a moment where his viewers is kind of stagnating, and it was just kind of thought that his channel wasn't going anywhere and all this stuff. Uh, yeah. Not going that. He thought his uh, viewers was stagnating and all this stuff, and uh, he was considering quitting his channel, and uh, he stopped doing that, but he, shortly before he made that announcement, I asked him if he had any advice uh, for handling games with higher difficulties, because I was really struggling with uh, uh, Kingdom Hearts at the time. And he said there's really no uh, no strategy I could offer except for practice. Practice makes perfect, essentially. So okay, great. Uh, thanks. And I told him that I was uh, streaming on Twitch, and I have my own 100% channel. And said, oh, and so that's uh, so great. It's so nice to hear like another person has a uh, offer to do that. I'm not going to do expert either. And it's just, it was really, it just been really nice about it and really supportive. And I just really appreciated that. But like a couple of weeks later, he announced that he was going to do his own uh, live stream series, where it's just essentially what I'm doing, where it's more or less a let's play of 100% and less so a walkthrough. But whether his is focused on games he's never played, mine is focused on games I have played. So, uh, it's really kind of interesting. It's really kind of interesting how he just went ahead and, uh... He went ahead and he did this after I just, uh, told him what this very thing that I'm doing on Twitch. And I can't help but feel like he only decided to do that because of me. Because I brought up... I don't know, it's just something I've been thinking about a while now, I just think it's kind of interesting. I really want to ask him, but I don't want to say, oh, I was thinking about this for a while, even before he said that to me, and said, oh, okay, so it's just a coincidence. But it's just something that I just think is really kind of cool. It's just, uh, <laughs> it's just kind of funny because he doesn't do face cams often. Like, I have, like, a really goofy face. I often don't do shit with my hair. In fact, I have sort of a little bowl cut with my hair. Just... Not really a bowl cut, I guess, but it's just... I don't do anything with my hair, so it's just I probably look goofy to some. 
But uh, the first time I saw his face, like, I swear to God, his face does not match his voice. Ow. I don't know, it's just something that I thought was kind of funny. Hey, like, this one thing I love about YouTube are content creators. Like, everyone's personality is unique, every channel is unique, have their unique styles, their unique levels of engagement, or whatever. Like, some people will do contests, some people do polls. Like, every streamer, every content creator is different. It's just kind of interesting how, uh, just me bringing up. What I'm doing, just I feel like that influenced what he did. I don't know, it's just another thing that's kind of cool. So many cogs, I'm not seeing cogs. need cogs. I need two cogs and I'm not getting any. Ugh. The sad thing is once I clear this place out. Oh. Oh, that's a gyro. Once I clear this place out, uh, it will remain cleared for three... I want to check this real quick. It will remain cleared for three, uh... 15 days. 15 in-game days. So I will need to wait a lot for everything to respawn. I'm pretty sure waiting around 15 days this doesn't actually affect it. So I actually have to play the game for 15 in-game days. Let me go ahead and check my emails to see if this teacher got back in touch with me. My friend is an idiot. Uh, okay, cool. I can stream the full four hours. Dear Zach, I'm happy to give you an extension until 11.59 on Wednesday. Thank you so much, Dr. Kelly. I can stream the full four hours now. Holy sh- I am gonna turn on my fan because I am sweating my ass off and I want my Gatorade I put by my Xbox. Okay, let me actually just check because I turned that fan off because I felt like that my mic was picking up the fan. It's picking up a little bit. I'm gonna actually turn it down one stage. Yeah, I think it's better. If you hear any worrying, I really do apologize. Feel free to let me know if it gets really annoying. It's just. My room is like a, uh, feels like a Japanese bathhouse, let's just say that. I really want to say something else, something else more colorful, but, uh, don't want to offend people, and I know Japanese bathhouses are pretty common, it's just, I feel like, I want to say they're pretty common, it's just, I'm not entirely sure, I don't know if Japan's gone away from that, but I do know they exist. I'm done. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Uh, the course. I haven't really gotten in here. Oh, 
Did I just kill it with my shout? For some reason, I didn't think I could do it. Excuse me. I didn't think I could do that. Really do not like to burp or fart on stream. I think that's just so unprofessional, and I hate people that do that. I mentioned that in previous streams that I really hate the YouTuber, Nintendo Capri Sun. There's a one video he did where he said, Oh, I'm gonna fart, I'm gonna fart, and he puts his butt to the mic and just farts in the mic. I hate people that do that. And I really hate myself if I uh, end up burping or farting at the same time. This is a lie. If I accidentally burp from drinking like a seven up, I can't really help that. Uh, it's just something that I'm gonna have to uh, get used to. People make noises with their body. It's just being a human. But at the same time, I also get mad whenever my parents just knock on my door or say something. And like last time I streamed. My dad came up, opened my door, and he was standing there in his underwear. And if my camera was a little bit to the left, he would have seen my door. And uh, pretty sure I will get flagged for nudity. So that is something that uh, happened, and something that I am glad my camera didn't catch. Can I attack with you? So, uh... Ah, oh, here we are. So, uh, that is something that I kind of have to get used to. It's just... People make noises. People have bodies. They have gases. Normal. Just I'm trying to be like really stressed about being professional and all this stuff, but same time, can't really help it if it's your body just and things. At the same time, I also shouldn't get mad whenever my mom or dad just knock on my door. It's just I don't know. It's just really dumb, I guess. Look at the map. So we're there. So let's say this is the way to go. Explore the other passengers. I also cannot stress this enough. I bring this up every stream. I don't want to have to uh, put myself on Do Not Disturb. Because if I do that, uh, then I will not show my achievements. I'll be seeing my friends. Getting online, don't be that type of person who says, uh, Hey, uh, hey, so and so, uh, you're a. That's what the heck? What's the difference between dormant gear and a dormant cog? Hey, uh, so and so, uh, you're a friend with, uh, Arson Meltdown 3, or I'm pretty sure you would know me as Z Boy. Uh, but whatever, it's just. Don't do that. I don't want to have to mute myself, uh, or put myself on do not disturb if I don't have to. So it's just, don't be that person. He did that. Actually, that armor hurt that much. But took me by surprise. Uh, I need two more cogs. I'm not seeing any cogs, dude. This farmer have a lot of gold. Don't don't that. Was unaware that being a farmer was a uh, profitable profession.
How much inventory do I have? I have enough for one more cog. And just one pound to spare. Alright. Lydia, pack meal. How can I serve you? One of these days I'm gonna actually part ways with her. Uh, let's see. Let it go with. What weapon does she have? 23. I'm gonna go ahead and give her this. I'll take it off her and uh, sell it later. I think that should be enough, realistically. To get through the rest of this dungeon. Kind of keep on. I don't know, like, how what you would call this. I want to say dry heat, but that's like when you are going to throw up and nothing comes up. It's like I have like a little hiccup or something. I don't know. I can keep on having that moment where I just breathe in and I feel like I'm about uh, to burp or something. I, I don't know. It's just, I don't know how to describe it. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know what the word I'm looking for is, but it's just I'm missing something about vocabulary. Uh, 